and in this video we're going to use on shape to uh, create iso number six uh, to do this uh, we're going to create uh, the overall shape overall uh, cube and then do some subtractive methods on it uh, so we're going to start by making our overall shape so if we count it goes over nine and it goes up one two three four five uh, so we'll start by making that cube uh, so create a document name it ISO 6 and then we get can get started by sketching again I'm going to go on the front plane and I'm going to just going to do a cube I'm going to change that front view to make it easy for us to see and click and then we said over 9 hit enter and then up 5 and hit enter uh, I hit my green check. I'm going to hit that front corner view so it's easy for us to see. And then we have to count how far to extrude. So if we look, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, so we extrude, click on the box, and we change that depth to five and hit enter. Uh, next, I'm going to cut out this uh, rectangle portion. I'm just going to use the chain fit tool again. You can see it goes all the way from the bottom to the top, so that would be a distance of 5. And then we have to figure out how much we have left here. So the easiest way is to count. I have 1, 2, 3, 4 uh, left. I started with 9, so that would mean I have uh, 9 minus 4, which is 5. Uh, so the equal distance, so that makes it a little bit easier on us. So I'm going to hit the chain fit tool. I'm going to click on that corner and I'm going to change my distance to 5 and hit enter. And you can see it makes that cutout that we're looking for. Uh, next, we'll add in that box cutout. So we hit the check to accept that. And then we need this box cutout for this front portion. I'm going to sketch it on kind of the left side or from if you're looking directly up from the tr from the cutout, the back of it, it's going to be the left side, left view, and you can see it's going to go up a distance or down from the top a distance of one, two, three, and in a distance of one, two, three. Uh, so we come back to our shape. I need to start a sketch, and I need to click on that left side. So I click on it, and I want it to start in that corner. So I'm going to click on my left view. I'm just going to make a rectangle. I'm going to start in that top right hand corner. I click and then I'll just click and then I can type my values in. It goes three down and three over. That's easy enough. I hit my green check and then I want to extrude it through all. So I'm going to hit extrude, click in the box I just created, but it says blind. I want to change that to uh, through all. And then if we change our view, we can see it's, oops, so we forgot to click remove, we can remove it through all. Uh, we do our green check, and you can see now we've created ISO number 6. Uh, hopefully this helps in your creation of ISO 6. Uh, good luck.